I'm not working now. My salary is closed. My kids are not learning. And even the eats are little, so things are not moving on well. I was not going to school because of the disease of coronavirus because our teachers told us but today we are not go going to school but I was very sad. Now when I'm home I help my mother to clean pigs giving them banana pills and water. If you go to school, you get more knowledge, but even schools, need, they are needed. They are needed to get more skills. So me, I have some project of mine. They go at the farm and they help me. So that's the way I'm maintaining them. If, the, if I don't get those newspapers at the supermarket, we got the farm and do our skills from there so that they may learn more. actually the same the whole figure so perimeter is going to be so this is example one and then also example two is When the lockdown was lifted I and the schools were still not going to open, I felt that that was going to be an opportunity for me to get somebody who could help to fill these gaps before school starts so that by the time she goes back, she's in a better place with the things that she's behind on. I couldn't make a full assessment of them, so I needed somebody who could do that for me. Being at school, well, it takes a long time, but at home, I learned how to type my work a few weeks ago, so, so it takes about one hour. And if you multiply those exact numbers, you still get the same number. Six oranges, and then you take away two of them. How many do you have left? Kids would wish to sit down and study, or to go and consult the teacher in the neighborhood. The challenge they have is maybe they have an avocado tree. They will go remove the avocados and start hooking them so that they can have something to put in their stomach. 
So however much we we would wish for equality, or I would say however much we would wish for equity, the fact is we are far from that.